I want to show you something really cool about physics and engineering. So in this problem, we have a 20 kilogram ball and the ball is being spun around in a circle by this machine in the center here. It takes 20 seconds for the ball to complete one full cycle. We are asked in this problem to calculate the centripetal force which is going to be acting on the ball. So I grabbed the centripetal force equation from a previous astrophysics video. This is a general centripetal force formula. It does not just apply to astronomical objects. We can also use this for mechanical situations like this. We have four pi squared and these are just constant I'll multiply that by the mass of this ball, which is 20 kilograms. I'll multiply this by the radius of the circle, and I can divide this whole thing by the period squared. Now, 4 is the same thing as 2 times 2. And the reason I'm writing it like this is because 2 times 10 is 20, and we have another 20, so both of these 20s will cancel with the two 20s on bottom. And if I want to change 2 pi squared to a decimal, this is approximately 19.74 newtons of force. So this is the magnitude of centripetal force keeping the 20 kilogram ball in this circular motion.